हेलो एंड वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू ऑल माय डियर लवली स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल स्टूडेंट्स यू मस्ट हैव सीन पार्ट वन ऑफ दिस वीडियो इन विच आई हैव एक्सप्लेन यू द स्टोरी द फाइट एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू सेकेंड पार्ट ऑफ द स्टोरी सो स्टूडेंट्स वी हैव सीन इन पार्ट वन आई विल क्विकली रिवाइज विद ऑल ऑफ यू वेयर वी लेफ्ट लास्ट टाइम वी हैव सीन दैट वेन द टू बॉयज दे वर फाइटिंग एंड दे हैव सीन द स्ट्रेंथ ऑफ ईच अदर दे वर टायर्ड दे वर एग्जॉस्टेड इज एंड टेड एंड इमिडिएटली एट दैट मोमेंट ओनली एन आइडिया केम टू द वॉरियर्स माइंड दैट वी शुड रिज्यूम द फाइटिंग टूमोरो एज वेल okay so he further warned ranji that if he dared to come to the pool again the next day they would have to fight again and he would not show any leniency as he did that day so ranji also replied that he would see him the next day all prepared to fight and uh, then what happened that they turned from each other and went to the rocks to wear uh, their clothes and they both went out of the forest into their respective directions right now students we will see what happened in part 2 So when Ranji got home he found it difficult to explain the cuts and bruises that showed on his face leg and arms it was difficult to conceal the fact that he had been in an unusually violent fight and his mother insisted on his staying at home for the rest of the day That evening though he slipped out of the house and went to the bazaar where he found comfort and solace in a bottle of vividly colored lemonade and a banana leaf full of hot sweet jalebis He had just finished the lemonade when he saw his adversary coming down the road his first impulse was to run turn away and look elsewhere his second to throw the lemonade bottle at his enemy but he did neither of these things instead he stood his ground and scowled at his passing adversary and the warrior said nothing either but scowled back with equal ferocity now students first of all i will tell you the meaning of difficult words so see द मीनिंग ऑफ द वर्ड सोलेस सोलेस मतलब होता है सैडनेस ओके यू कैन से कम्फर्ट और कॉन्सोलेशन इन अ टाइम ऑफ ग्रेट डिस्ट्रेस और सैडनेस और राइट सोलेस मीन्स कम्फर्ट और कॉन्सोलेशन इन अ टाइम ऑफ ग्रेट डिस्ट्रेस और सैडनेस students next word is vividly vividly means in a way that produces uh, powerful feelings or uh, clear images in the mind right impulse impulse it is a sudden strong and unreflective urge or desire to act scowled to matlab pata hi hoga looked angrily and our adversary kehte hain opponent ko jo enemy hota hai ferocity means uh, cruelty okay fierceness now students i will explain you the meaning of this uh, paragraph when ranji reached his home he found himself stuck in a situation where it became difficult for him to justify all the cuts scratches and the injuries on his body it became nearly impossible for him to hide that he had been in an uncommon rough fight his mother commanded him to stay indoors for the remaining part of the day and despite the instructions he went out of the house steadily to go to the bazaar in the evening right now there he found comfort and consolation in the brightly colored lemonade and hot uh, sweet jalebis that was served on a banana leaf as he finished drinking his lemonade now what he saw he he just caught sight of his enemy yes the same boy who fought with him uh, day before yesterday so he was coming down the road and his immediate thought was to turn uh, towards the other side and look somewhere else means uh, to ignore him okay second uh, secondly he got an urge to throw the lemonade bottle at his 
at his uh, approaching opponent but then students he resisted and did not act upon uh, his unreflective desires all right he uh, just uh, stood there firmly as he stared angrily at his enemy you can see in the picture also how uh, cool he was before and after seeing his enemy how disappointed he is so the warrior too on the other hand passed by the fighter while giving him angry glances backed by equal fierceness now students next paragraph the next day was as hot as the previous one ranji felt weak and lazy and not at all eager for a fight his body was stiff and sore after the previous days encounter but he uh, but he could not refuse the challenge not to turn up at the pool would be an acknowledgement of defeat from the way he left he felt just then he knew he would be beaten in another fight but he could not acquiesce in his own defeat he must defy his enemy to the last or outfit him for only then could he gain his respect if he surrendered now he would be beaten for all time but to fight and be beaten today left him free to fight and be beaten again as long as he fought he had a right to the pool in the forest now uh, students difficult words are sore sore means painful or aching okay encounter means um, uh, unexpectedly be faced uh, with or experience and accuse means accept quietly outfit uh, means deceive by greater ingenuity right now i will explain you the meaning of this uh, paragraph the temperature students it was very hot on the next day also because summer still rahe the na so it was very hot and it was next day the temperature was just as high as the previous day pehle din se bhi zyada garmi so ranji lacked the power and will to fight because he felt tired abhi pehle ki thakan hi nahi gayi hai his body was aching and he felt rigid because of the previous day's confrontation now students despite feeling this way he could not afford to back from the challenge if it if he did not uh, go near the pool that day na it would mean that he had accepted his loss he was well aware that if he fought in this condition he would anyway end up losing in a violent fight but he couldn't sit quietly and see himself lose okay so he was uh, you know very much confident also from inside that uh, how can i just accept my uh, accept my you know like uh, that only main apni haar aise kaise maan lu hai na so uh, in order to gain respect he uh, he needed to win against his opponent or at least outsmart him so because if he gave up he would uh, he would mean that he, he has accepted his defeat for lifetime but if he showed student if he showed up and even got uh, beaten up by the other boy it would set him free and he could uh, fight again if, uh, even if it meant being beaten up once more but he knew that as long as he showed up for the fight he reserved himself a fight a right to swim in the pool in the forest so somewhere we should have that uh, determination and that confidence in us that we will win okay next paragraph he was hoping that the warrior would have forgotten the challenge but these hopes were dashed when he saw his opponent sitting stripped on the waist on a rock on the other side of the pool the warrior was rubbing oil on his body he saw ranji beneath the sal trees and called a challenge across the waters of the pool come over on this side and fight he shouted but ranji was not going to submit to any conditions laid down by his opponent come this side and fight he shouted back with equal vigor swim across and fight me here called the other or perhaps you cannot swim the length of this pool now students i'll explain you uh, the difficult words meaning of difficult words dashed means destroyed 
ओके स्ट्रिप्ट मतलब होता है विदाउट क्लोथ्स एंड विगर मतलब स्ट्रेंथ तो स्टूडेंट्स वी सी दैट ऑल दो रानजी वॉज ऑन इज वे टू शो अप द फाइट ही वॉज हाफ होपिंग इन इज माइंड दैट द अदर बॉय वुड हैव फेल्ड टू रिमेंबर अबाउट द चैलेंज ओके एंड अनफॉर्चुनेटली ऑल एक्सपेक्टेशंस केम क्रैशिंग डाउन वेन ही कॉट साइट ऑफ इज एनिमी सिटिंग नेकेड टिल द वेस्ट ऑन अ रॉक ऑन द अदर साइड एज यू कैन सी इन द पिक्चर ऑल्सो ओके सो देन वॉट हैपन स्टूडेंट्स दैट हिज एक्सपेक्टेशन हैज़ क्रैश्ड ऑल राइट एंड वैन ही जस्ट सो दैट ही वॉज सिटिंग ऑन द अदर साइड ऑफ द पूल ना ही वॉज रबिंग ऑयल ऑन हिज बॉडी एज ही प्रिपेयर हिमसेल्फ फॉर द फाइट सो ही सॉ रानजी अंडर नीथ द साल ट्रीज एंड चैलेंज हिम फ्रॉम राइट अक्रॉस द पूल ही चैलेंज हिम सी ही इज चैलेंजिंग in the picture you can see challenged him from uh, right across the pool and the strange boy shouted from the other side and told ranji to come over to his side and fight so ranji wasn't going to surrender to the conditions that were being laid down by the by his enemy so thus he replied with equal strength and told him to come to his side instead so other boy asked him to swim across the fight with him okay so he even mocked ranji matlab mocked matlab mazak banate hue by indicating that he was not coming to the other side oh dusri taraf isliye nahi aa raha hai because he cannot swim the length of the pool okay now further we see that but ranji could could have swum the length of the pool a dozen times without tiring and here he would uh, show the warrior his superiority so slipping out of his vest he dived straight into the water cutting through it like a knife and surfaced with hardly a splash the warrior's mouth hung open in amazement you can dive he exclaimed It is easy," said Ranji, treading water, waiting for a further challenge. "Can't you dive?" "No," said the other. "I just straighten. But if you will tell me how, I will make a dive." "It is easy," said Ranji. "Stand on the rock, stretch your arms out, and allow your head to displace your feet." नाउ स्टूडेंट्स ये डाइव मतलब होता है मीन्स वैन यू प्लंज हेड फर्स्ट इन टू वाटर विद विद वन आर्म्स रेज ओवर वंस हेड ओके एंड ट्रेडिंग वेटर ट्रेडिंग वाटर मतलब होता है बच्चों कीपिंग वन सेल्फ अपराइट इन डीप वाटर बाय मूविंग द फीट ठीक है नो वॉट हैपन Ranji could actually swim the length of the pool a uh, multiple times without even getting tired usko to aadat thi so thus he thought of showing the warrior his excellence he removed his vest and dived right into the pool cutting through it like a knife and came smoothly on to the surface the warrior's jaw dropped in surprise wo to bahut मतलब उसको तो एकदम शॉक लग गया तो उसने कहा यू कैन डाइव रानजी टोल्ड हिम दैट इट वाज क्वाइट सिंपल हा मैं तो कर सकता हूँ एंड वाई कीपिंग हिमसेल्फ अपराइड इन द वाटर ना बाय मूविंग इज फीट रानजी आज द अदर बॉय अब कि तुम भी क्या डाइव कर सकते हो तो स्ट्रेंज बॉय रिप्लाई दैट ही कुडेंट एंड यूज टू जम्प राइट इन द पोल तो ही आस रानजी कि अगर तुम मुझे प्लीज सिखाओगे इफ यू कुड यू नो टीच हिम हाउ टू डाइव तो रानजी टोल्ड हिम कि इट वाज क्वाइट वेरी इजी ही ओनली नीडेड टू स्टैंड ऑन द रॉक स्ट्रेच हिज आर्म्स आउट एंड अलाउ हिज हेड टू डिस्प्लेस हिज फीट ठीक है नाउ द वॉरियर स्टूड अप stiff and straight stretched out his arms and threw himself into the water he landed flat on his belly with a crash that sent the birds screaming out of the trees ranji dissolved in into laughter are you trying to empty the pool he asked as the warrior came to the surface spouting water like a small whale wasn't it good asked the boy evidently proud of his feet not very good said ranji you should have more practice see i will do it again 
and pulling himself up on a rock he executed another perfect dive the other boy waited for him to come up but swimming under water ranji circled him and came upon him from behind how did you do that asked the astonished youth can't you swim under water asked ranji no but i will try it the warrior made a tremendous effort to plunge to the bottom of the pool and instead he thought he had gone right down though his bottom like uh, like a ducks remained above surface ranji however did not discourage him it was not bad he said but you need a lot of practice now students difficult words are dissolved dissolved matlab hota hai you know like uh, an expression of strong feelings you break into spouting matlab hota hai send out matlab liquid forcibly in a stream feat feat means a clever act and astonished matlab hota hai greatly surprised or impressed plunge matlab hota hai bachcho jump ab dekhiye warrior did just as the fighter had suggested ab to matlab wo seekhne laga hai na usse how to dive into the water so he st- uh, stood up stiff and straight stretched out his arms and threw himself into the water to kya hota hai ki he landed straight on his belly uh, causing a collision causing a collision that scared away the birds as they came out of the trees screaming theek hai this made ranji laugh uncontrollably uncontrollably ranji mocked him and asked if his intention was to empty the pool kya matlab itni zor se aayo pani sa splash kar diya hai kya pani khali karne ka irada hai pool se so it was only then that the warrior came back to the surface of the pool and splashed water off his mouth like a small whale so the boy was quite proud of the way he performed the dive he wanted to know uh, what ranji thought about it and asked him if, uh, if it wasn't good according to him na ranji se ranji to acha kar le raha hai to usne dikha bhi diya karke to isiliye wo se advice suggestion le raha hai so ranji told him that it was not good it was not that good and he needed more practice he told the warrior to observe him doing it again ab main fir se karunga main he came out of the water stood on the rock and performed another flawless dive to bachcho kya hota hai ki strange boy waited for him to come up on the surface while ranji moved hai na uh, around him in a circle and then finally showed up from behind him to amazed as he was the other boy asked ranji how he did it matlab itna hairan itna shock ho gaya kara kaise tumne ye kaise kar liya ranji asked the boy if he did not if he did not also know how to swim under water the boy told him he couldn't but he was definitely willing to give it a try to kya hota hai ये लोग ना मतलब ही गैदर्ड ऑल इज स्ट्रेंथ एंड वेंट टू द बॉटम ऑफ द पूल एंड वाइल द वॉरियर थॉट दैट ही हैड मेड स्ट्रेट अवे टू द बॉटम तो हिज बॉटम हैड रिमेंड अबव द सरफेस लाइक अ डक जैसे डक का रह जाता है ना ऊपर बिल्कुल ऊपर का दिखता है लेग्स तो दिखती नहीं है सो रानजी डिड नॉट वॉन्ट टू डिस्करेज हिम सो ही टोल्ड हिम इट वॉज नॉट बैड बट ही स्टिल नीडेड अ लॉट ऑफ प्रैक्टिस ठीक है नाव next we see will you teach me asked his enemy if you like i will teach you you must teach me if you do not teach me i will beat you will you come here every day and teach me if you like said ranji they had pulled themselves out of water and were sitting side by side on a smooth gray rock my name is suraj said the warrior what is yours it is ranji i am strong am i not asked suraj bending his arm so that a ball of muscle stood up stretching the white of his of his flesh you are strong said ranji you are a real pehlwan one day i will be the world's champion wrestler said suraj slapping his thighs which shook 
with his with the impact of his hand he looked critically at ranji's hard thin body you are quite strong yourself he con- uh, he conceded but you are too bony i know you people do not eat enough you must come and have your food with me i drink one seer of milk every day we have got our own cow be my friend and i will make you a pelwan like me i know if you teach me to dive and swim under water i'll make you a pelwan that is fair isn't it that is fair said ranji though he doubted if he was getting the better of the exchange now student seer matlab kya hota hai seer matlab same as uh, sir you know a unit of weight used previously in india matlab a sir hum kehte hain na a sir a little less than a liter hai na was one f- uh, uh, 40th of a mond और कंसीडेड मतलब क्या होता है एडमिटेड समझ में आ गई तो अब क्या होता है स्टूडेंट्स की द बॉय आज रानजी इफ़ यू वुड टीच हिम रानजी टोल्ड हिम दैट ही वुड इफ़ ही वाज विलिंग टू लर्न और बॉय टोल्ड हिम इन फैक्ट रानजी मस्ट टीच हिम एंड ही डिडेंट एंड इफ़ ही डिडेंट है ना ही वुड गेट बीटन अप अब मैं दोनों दोस्त बन गए हैं अब दोस्तों वाली बात हो रही है तो ही आस्ट रानजी इफ़ ही वुड कम टू द पूल डेली टू टीच हिम तो रानजी कहता है कि अगर वो आएगा इफ ही वुड लाइक अगर वो चाहेगा अगर वो पसंद करेगा तो मैं आऊँगा और वो दोनों फिर पानी में से बाहर निकलते हैं बोथ ऑफ देम जस्ट यू नो गॉट आउट ऑफ द वाटर एंड सेट बाई ईच अदर साइड ऑन अ स्मूथ ग्रे रॉक ठीक है तो वॉरियर इंट्रोड्यूस्ड हिमसेल्फ एज सूरज एंड आस्ट हिज ओपोनेंट्स नेम रानजी टोल्ड हिम इज नेम तो सूरज सेड दैट ही वॉज स्ट्रॉन्ग एंड आस्ट रानजी दैट ही हैड टू से अबाउट इट एज ही बेंट हिज आर्म इन अ टाइट एंड वे सो दैट हिज मसल्स स्टूड आउट स्ट्रेचिंग आउट ऑफ हिज वाइट फ्लैश रानजी टोल्ड हिम दैट ही वॉज स्ट्रॉन्ग इन डीड ही टोल्ड सूरज that he was a real pehlwan wrestler while slapping his thighs which shook with its impact suraj exclaimed that he will become the world's champion wrestler one day ek din hai na he stared at ranji's thin and hard body with judging eyes and told him that he was also strong but also very bony and thin to so, suraj said ki that he knew na it was because he didn't eat enough so he further uh, invited ranji to have food with him sometime and see how he used to drink one seer of milk every day so he told ranji about uh, their own cow, uh, cow also he was having so he offered uh, to help ranji to become a pehlwan okay and uh, ranji also agreed to become his friend so suraj uh, said that if ranji would uh, teach him how to dive and swim under water he would help ranji become as strong as a wrestler he asked ranji if it was fair ranji agreed that it was fair although he doubted if he was getting more benefit out of it theek hai ab dekho suraj put his arm around the younger boy and said we are friends now yes they looked at each other with honest unflinching uh, eyes and in that moment moment love and understanding were born we are friends said ranji the birds had settled again in their branches and the pool was quiet uh, and limped in the shade of the salt trees it is our pool said suraj nobody else can come here without our permission would who would dare it is our pool said suraj okay so who would dare said ranji smiling with the knowledge that he had won the day students unflinching matlab hota hai without blinking theek hai looking straight at each other or limpid matlab hota hai clear to ab dekho bachcho kya hota hai ki suraj put his arm around ranji and asked him ki if they were friends now 
और फिर क्या होता है दे जस्ट लुक इन टू ईच अदर्स आईज विद कम्प्लीट ऑनेस्टी एंड विदाउट ब्लिंकिंग देयर आईज एंड एट दैट पर्टिकुलर मूवमेंट ओनली लव एंड अंडरस्टैंडिंग एमर्ज बिटवीन द टू रानजी रिप्लाइड दैट दैट दे वर फ्रेंड्स ठीक है और तब तक बाय दैट टाइम द बर्ड्स दैट वॉज केयर्ड अवे ना हैड कम बैक टू दी ब्रांचेज वो लोग भी वापस आ जाते हैं और जो पूल था वो स्टिल एंड क्लियर अंडर द शेड ऑफ द सैलरीज अब सूरज जो है ही एक्सक्लेम दैट फ्रॉम नाउ ऑनवर्ड्स इट वॉज देयर पूल एंड नो वन एल्स कुड यूज इट विदाउट देयर परमिशन He said, "Who would dare?" Ranji repeated after him in agreement. Na, jese puri sahmati ke saath. Who would dare? As he smiled with the thought that he had conquered the day. Now, students, see what is the conclusion of the uh, story. The story, the fight. So, students, see the fight summary teaches us that uh, fighting will not do anyone any good. and we should never be too proud instead uh, we should help each other one another and establish love and not hate with each other okay this is the uh, moral of the story i hope you all like the story thank you very much for listening and have a great day ahead